We all know that Jesus said some pretty amazing things. Uh, and I think one of the most amazing things he said were these words that I often come back to. From John 17, verse 26, he says this, I have made you known to them, and I will continue to make you known, in order that the love you have for me might be in them. Now, this is Jesus speaking to his heavenly Father. And he's talking about what he's been doing and what he wants to do is to you know, reveal who the Father is so that the love that the Father had for Jesus might be a love that we know as well. Let's just look at a few aspects of this verse. He says that he's made the Father known. And I think making the Father known must include what Jesus did as he healed the sick. If you think about what a major part healing plays in the Gospels. It's therefore a major part of what Jesus wants to show us about his Father. It's the Father's will that I think we pursue healing and find healing in this life. And if you're one who's seeking healing, whether it's your, your body, your mind, your emotions, it's okay. You're doing something that God wants you to be doing. So that, of course, does raise the question, well, what does it say then when healing doesn't happen? Uh, as we'd like it to happen? Does it mean that he isn't at work? Well, no, it doesn't, actually. I think what it means is there's still something going on whereby he is still revealing something of the Father's heart to us. And we might need to look for that elsewhere uh, and try and just find what else he's doing. But actually making God known to us is what he's committed to doing in our lives. He's always showing us something of the Father's heart to us. But it goes on and says the reason he's showing the Father's heart to us is that we might know the Father's love for ourselves. And actually we might know it just as much as Jesus knew it. And that is stunning, I think, and if we could really do that, you know, what difference could that make to us if we really understood how deeply, deeply loved we were by Father God? What difference would it make? Well, I think we wouldn't see God as playing strange games with us. We wouldn't need to compare ourselves to anybody else ever again. We wouldn't need to hide ourselves or any part of ourselves from God. I think we'd love ourselves more than we do. I think as well, somehow his love would more naturally flow out from us to other people. This is such a beautiful verse. Uh, it opens a wonderful window for us onto the activity of Jesus. He's showing us more and more about the Father's heart and the Father's love for us. I think it is great hope as we pray for healing uh, and great I think, wonder as we begin to ponder how much love he actually has for us.